Happy Saturday. I'm pretty sure by now um, you can see that I have on a blue lipstick. And I can remember when I first saw this color, I thought it was a beautiful color, but I talked myself out of buying it because you don't see people walking around with blue lipstick every day. But then I thought, you know what? I have to be true to me and what I want. And I bought the lipstick and now I'm wearing the lipstick. Um, I recently made another bold move as well. I have been with the same company for over 17 years and as of yesterday, I am moving on to new adventures. I have worked with some of the most amazing people. I will never forget, uh, I had to have surgery. Um, I made it home and recovering on my couch, laying down, and I received a text from someone on the production team and his text said, we want you to know that 12 men in black are praying for you. I will never forget that. It meant the world to me. And that's just one story out of hundreds of stories that I will carry on with me. I have worked with people on the road, um, in our office, and I can truly say that I am a better person, a better mother, and a better wife because of each one of you. And we had the opportunity to see great things happen in the lives of women all over the world. Thank you for those times. But enough of me talking about me. Now I have a question for you because what I found is when we share our stories, we are never alone. And I know that there is someone watching this that has been thinking about making a different move, but you are talking yourself out of it, telling yourself all the reasons why you shouldn't do it. And today, I just want to challenge you to be true to you, to step out on faith and to see what happens. You never know. We only have one life to live and we don't want any regrets. I'm so excited about my future. I'm excited about your future. And I hope you will join me and stay connected by reading my blog on exposedonline.com. There I will provide words of encouragement. I'll share some of the stories that have happened in my life and how I was able to overcome them. I'll share the stories of others. And most importantly, it's a place where I want to provide hope and encouragement to those who need it. I am so grateful for each one of you, and I can't wait to see what God does in your life as well as mine. Take care, and I'll talk to you soon. Bye.